What's that? Footprints. Sam! God damn it. I'm sure he's a ways off by now. Just gonna head to the creepy mountain, save Sam, get the hell out of here. Yeah, be laughing about the whole thing tomorrow. Back on the trail. The footprints end here. Come on, which way did he go? Footprints. Well, you didn't fall to your death, so that's good. Still get a chance to kill you. Christ. this. Jesus! I swear, Sam, if Rafe and Nadine don't kill you, I just might.
Oh god, this is so much harder than it looks. I can do it! All right. Oh, shit! I was too close. I guess this is my way down. Sam.
almost done here? This is the last of them, man. Good. If we are here, we can catch up with the others. <sighs> Sam just stole our goddamn boat. He's headed for Avery's ship. Come on. Let him. We're done. We're done. Most of my men are dead, Rafe. And those who aren't have already left. Can you see that? The end is literally in sight. That maniac pirate of yours has rigged this entire cave. I'm not setting foot on his ship. Nadine, if you cut and run right now, the loss of all your men, everything that we've done, it's for nothing. We have millions in gold right here. I'd say that plus our lives is something. No wonder so many of your men abandoned you. Excuse me? We're on the verge of making history here, and you're willing to just walk off with a pittance, a fraction of what Sam's gonna get from that boat. If he can walk away from that ship alive, he can have it. Hell, I'd say he's earned it. God knows you didn't. Now look, we can stand here and insult each other all day, or we can finish what it is that we've Oh, we're finishing it all right. Sorry, ma'am. Thing about mercenaries, Nadine, their loyalty, it's bought. It's not earned. Now come on. Either we can finish this thing together, or we can just end it right here. Let's go make history. And a girl. By all means. <laughs> See what you have in store for us, Captain Avery.
Hey, Nate. Where is Sam? Oh, he's right there. Sam? Relax, he's alive. This idiot nearly got us all killed. I'm getting him out of here. No, you're not. Rafe, you can have the treasure, all right? Just let me save my brother. <laughs> <laughs> After everything he's done? How noble of you, but no. We stay here any longer and we're all dead. Is that what you want? That's not what I said. What do you think, Nadine? <coughs> Good to see you up and about. Be a deer and relieve Nate there of his gun. Hand it over. You really think you can trust him? Huh? Not your concern. Now why are you trying to instigate? Nate? Nadine and I are our partners. I don't screw over my partners. Get over there. You and your brother, though. Right from the start, you took advantage of my generosity. You tried to cut me out, and it's high time you learn. What are you doing? Now you give me your gun. <laughs> Nadine? I won't ask you again. You are being profoundly stupid right now. Look over there. <laughs> Stop screwing around. Jesus! I said look! Okay, it's a couple of skeletons. So what? I don't know as much about history as you boys, but I've got a pretty good idea who those two are. Well, enlighten us. It's Avery and two. They killed each other. Good for them. What's the point? Everyone obsessed with this treasure gets what they deserve. So what, you're just leaving us here to die? Oh, I'm just leaving. Whether you die or not, I don't really care. Nadine, wait. So long, Rafe. Nadine! Nadine! You open this goddamn door right now! Rafe, she's gone! Come on, give me a hand, we'll all get out of here. won't work. Come on, help me with Sam and I'll help you open the door. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy one of these coins. Knowing that you and your worthless brother are still sucking here. Hey, just, just calm down. You can practice your fencing when we get outside. Nate, just shut up. Seriously, Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shambhal. That's Jesus. Nathan Drake found the lost city in the middle of the Rub al Kali Desert. <laughs> Jesus. Come on, we can get out of here together. Nathan Drake discovered the fabled El Dorado. Jesus. Come on, Rafe, stop. Nathan Drake is a legend. <laughs> you know, I, I shot the man who told me that. Look, I get it, you don't like me very much. You know, for all your greatness, Nate, you have nothing. You are nothing. And I warned you to get out of my way. I have sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves a senile con man and a washed up journalist take that away from me! So long, Nate. Sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves 
A senile con man and a washed up journalist. Take that away from me! So long, Nate. Sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves, a senile con man, and a washed up journalist take that away from me! You care about that parade of losers so much? I'm going to make sure they join you. On guard, dickhead. That's the spirit. You know how to sword fight? Yeah. You stick you with the sharp end, right? Oh, that should be fun. Ship, you be my guest. You got me. You know what, Nate? Underneath all the bravado, you're just a sad little boy with delusions of grandeur. Who, by the way, can't fence for shit. So long, Nathan Drake. Nathan!
Treasure Wraith. It's all yours. You want the treasure Wraith? It's all yours. <laughs> Get you out of here. It's too heavy. Strike it. It's no use. Try again. It's no use. Come on. Damn it. Listen to me. Listen to me. All I ever wanted to do was find this treasure with you. Hey, sure. We did it. We did it, brother. Okay? It's all right. There's gonna be another way. Nathan, you gotta go. There's gonna be some. Gotta go. This tough. There is no other way. Come on, Nathan. I gotta know you made it out all right. No. Nathan, the whole place is about to blow up. That's it. That's it. What the hell are you doing? It's stressful. God damn it. Get your head down. Got everything? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, feel free to sell anything I left behind. <laughs> sure, I can't give you a lift home. After the last few days, I think I'd like a plane with drink service and reclining seats. Plus, uh, she and I have a lot to talk about. 
Yeah, you do. And no more late night phone calls about one last time. <laughs> Promise. Thanks, Sally. Take care, kid. Don't be a stranger. Next time you're in town, beers are on me. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> and then the bunny escapes anyway, and it leaves little bunny surprises all over the headmaster's bed. Hey, 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 <laughs> what are you telling her? Just about your little magic face. Oh, I hate you. What was your stage name? Go on, tell her. Nate the Great. <laughs> it's not funny. It makes sense. In his defense, he was actually, you were pretty good. Uh-huh. Hey, look, Sam, it has been an experience getting to meet you. But the handshake? Well... <laughs> Bring it in for the real thing, sister. You take care of this gnome skull, all right? Yeah, I will. I'll join you in a sec. Yeah. I like her. God help her, she sure seems to love you. <laughs> I know, right? Listen, the offer still stands. I appreciate it, but I'm good. I know, but if you feel like you're imposing, it's, you're not. We not talked about, about that, it. It's not about that. It's a little bit of that, okay? Yeah. But I just kind of thought that after we found Avery's treasure, I'd be satisfied. Uh -huh. Instead, I've uh, <laughs> kind of left with this strange feeling of emptiness. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know, as thrilling as the next adventure might be, in the end, I always left with that same feeling. And sometimes you just gotta choose what you're gonna keep and uh, what you're gonna let go. Well, I guess I'm just not there yet. And besides, you know, you've got a few ancient cities on me, and I can't let that slide, so... Yeah, I left a couple out there. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's... that's our ride. Yeah. Uh... Sam. I've come far. You sure have a little brother. Come here. Listen, you don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? Get out of here, vamos. <laughs> So, Victor, what's next for you, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> well, before I got dragged into this, I was working on a business deal of sorts. Of sorts? Hmm. Dangerous? Yeah. With these people, yeah. It's up there. Well, I just so happen to know a certain someone recently out of prison who might be perfect for this kind of work. Ooh, I don't know. Is he trustworthy? More or less. As is Portuguese. Quando seu marido volta para casa? What's that mean? How long before your husband gets home? <laughs> That'll do. Come on. You got any more of those cigars? Don't push your luck.
Mom? Dad? Anyone? Oh, cool. Sam and Sully are coming to visit. <laughs> Look at these two. Hey! <sighs> Off she goes. Ah, <sighs> perfect day. Now all we need is the rest of our boat crew. And not here either. Okay, I guess I'll just wait then. Goofy. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. There's no way. There's just no way. Spanish doubloon, but from where? Sixteenth century. Where is this from? Kind of creepy. Kind of cool. Gunsway heist? Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? No way. Is that Dad? Harvest Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Huh. What's this? What the hell? Oh shit. Rip. Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. 
ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I just need to, um... Uh, What's get... up, Cassie? Okay. Don't be mad. Hey, I said don't be mad. Keys. So, what did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully. With a bunch of Spanish looking treasure. In a sh It's bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a, a silver skull of some kind. You no, know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Really? Nate? It's time to have the talk. <sighs> yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talk are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of this. That is different, and you know it. Okay, look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> but I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ah, <sighs> funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see, um... For me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> it sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. Oh, she knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record, I totally delivered. <laughs> yeah, you delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. Oh, come on, you know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, pretty that's much right. it, yeah. Bullshit. Language. Language. Crap. Better. All right, so keep going. You know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. Well, wait, what would Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? Uh, that's the legend. Turned out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, well, I'll get back to that later. 